Hello, hello. Today um, we are going to do part three of chapter eight. Okay. Go ahead and do that. Okay. When we returned, the house was aglow with Christmas lights and decorations. I had put up the weekend following. I had put up the weekend following Thanksgiving. Kate oversaw the whole production, yelling at up to me on the ladder. Those lights are sizing too much. Or so Robert moved the wreath over the towards the center of the woman with uh, of a win, woman of the window a hair. By the end of the day, the house was something Mother would have been proud of, complete with the yard sale, nativity lights lighting the front yard. Lily bust through the front door, sweeping her nephew into her arms, gently tapping his small nose, exclaiming, Look at you! Look at you! I pulled out, out the, the dunghill billard and packed the cylinder bowl with tobacco that smelled like the forest of pine trees. I puffed on the plastic bit till the tobacco caught flicking in my right hand to um, put out the match. Dad, <coughs> Willie whined, do you need, do you have to light the thing? The cake didn't say a word. She never knew why I sporadically spite, smoked a pipe, but she never asked either. All she knew was it had something to do with bringing me back to her. And that's all she knew the night. Evan giggled as Kate raised him high in the air, mm -hmm. then brought him down towards her, sticking her nose in, in his round belly. Who's Grandma's angel, she asked, in, in a, a voice that I imagine altered every dog in the neighborhood. Who's grand, grand, Grandma's angel? The, boy, the baby laughed and giggled. His tiny arms and legs wiggling in the air. Lily offered her finger. Ugh, her finger. Lily offered her finger to other in the grass and proceeded to bounce his hand. <laughs> to bounce his hand. Uh, to bounce his hand. Ooh, where am I? Where am I at? And bounce his hand around like that of a tiny orchid guy conductor. While Kate lifted him repeatedly up and down, up and down. I sat back, puffing on the pipe and smiled at my crazy pet, my family, and wondered again what had happened to the small boy with the Christmas tree who changed my life forever. And that is it. And that is the end. Um, have a great day and we'll um, read the epilogue um, tomorrow. Yeah, so have a great day. Bye-bye.